Yes, indeed. Cheryl Cole. Oh, wrong. BBC DJ. Radio I hate one. that. Hate it. Does my head in. A lot of people getting extremely excited on the text messaging service. Eight double one double nine. About take that. Laura gave us a call. Hi, Laura. Hi, Ben. Hey, Laura. On a scale of one to ten, how excited are you about this take that tour? Oh, fifty. Whoa. <laughs> You'll wow. have to bear with me because I've lost my voice a little bit from last night, so I hope you can hear me okay. <laughs> All right, okay, so let, you're a massive Take That fan. Massive Take That fan. Are always you, happy. Always happy since, since the days of Could It Be Magic and all that kind of... Yep. <laughs> oh, did you see them on their original tours with them without yeah, Robbie? I've, I've been to see them on every tour. It, last night was the ninth time I've been to see them. Wow, you're the <laughs> ultimate thatter, I think yeah. is, is the phrase. Hey, that's good stuff. Uh, so, tell us about it. When, uh, did, when did, did you go for the first time yesterday? Yeah, well, I went to the first one in Sunderland, the opening night last week, and then I went to Manchester again last night, and we started queuing at quarter to seven in the morning to get a good spot. And right. It felt brilliant, we were right at the front. Ooh. I could sense your excitement through the airwaves, Laura. <laughs> what, what, what were you anticipating? What were you looking forward to? And what did you think it was going to be, the show, the Take That show? Well, I was a bit concerned because the circus show was amazing, so I thought, can they really beat that? But they definitely beat that. It was a brilliant show. Were there more fireworks? Were there more uh, more stage acts? I don't, what were I don't really want to spoil it for anybody who hasn't been because you've got to be surprised. But everything about it was just amazing. I'm still in awe at how brilliant it was. And they spent loads of time coming down into the crowd for so a few handshakes and a bit of a kiss off Jason Harry. Oh, she's going to have to <laughs> That's exactly what I would like. That's why my voice sounds like this now. <laughs> is, is he your favourite member of Take That? He is. I actually had a banner that said Future Mrs Orange and he, he was with that and then he came down off the stage and called me wife and gave me a little kiss on the hand. What? Oh, so for you! <laughs> <laughs> Did you take lots so, of pictures? We've got loads of photos. I'm just uploading them onto Facebook now. Oh, I've <laughs> got a new profile picture! <laughs> and all I could say all night was, oh my god, oh my god, that's, brilliant. that's all I can say, it was absolutely brilliant, and I'm uh, going again tomorrow. Oh my <laughs> god! <laughs> Alright, fair enough, so I, I, I guess you're a massive fan then, Laura? Definitely, the biggest fan, I think. Okay, now, Laura, uh, tell me this, uh, were, were you excited at the fact that they, do they do a medley of all the old hits? They do, they do plenty of the old hits, it's right. really amazing to see all five of them on stage together and doing the old dance routines and things, oh, so for it, all the old Take That fans, it's brilliant, is it, but to, to is be it, honest, it's brilliant for Robbie fans as well. Okay, is it, is it, could it be magic where they do that dance where they line up behind each other and then they wave the arms around yeah, like scarecrows in the wind? Yeah, they don't really go into that one too much, unfortunately. They don't do that routine, but oh. there's some nice surprises for the old fans in there, definitely. Did they do show? No, they did pray, and that was brilliant. Tell me they don't do babe. They do babe. Yeah, <laughs> really? They do, they do. Wow. They, it's surprising what songs they do, actually. It's, re it's a really good show. Okay, well, let's not give too much away, but Laura, uh, when are you going again, tonight or tomorrow? Tomorrow. Tomorrow. Who are you taking oh. with you tomorrow? I'm going actually by myself tomorrow, meeting up with some of my friends later on because they're not as sad as me, so they won't queue up all day. But do you know what? Do you know, do you know what, Laura? I'm glad you said that live on air because if <laughs> I'd have said it, it would have been very insulting. Well, it's, I might as well be sat outside sunbathing and get right to the front and be at home waiting. So and then you could quite literally be Mrs. Orange. Well, who knows? Fingers crossed. <laughs> yeah, fingers crossed. Are you going to take a banner this time that says, "Hey, Definitely. it was me"? The same banner. The same banner. Right. <laughs> oh, I love that. I love that. Look, do you have a special Take That concert outfit? No, no, I like to wear different things. I don't normally wear my Take That t-shirts out in public, but I might get one <laughs> <up> tomorrow. <laughs> because you're not actually that mad. I am that mad, but I right. just get abused. <laughs> oh, fab. Laura, have a great time tomorrow. I will do. Thanks on your own. Then. Yeah. Uh, all the best. Take care. Cheers. Bye. Bye. At least she was honest. I like Laura a lot. The ultimate take that fan. Good for you, Laura. And good luck, Jason Orange.